Cooking food is a process controlled by the laws of thermodynamics and chemical kinetics. Heating accelerates the chemical reactions that change the chemicals in food in favourable ways, and it breaks down cellular structures to tenderise and release nutrients. Cooking is also very important for food safety, as it destroys many harmful organisms that contaminate raw food. Cooking with water is common practice, but with drawbacks. Cooking in a pot, even with the lid on, wastes energy as steam escapes and those delightful cooking aromas are flavours lost. Cooking with water is a kinetic process, driven by the boiling temperature of water. Once the water is boiling, the temperature and cooking time are fixed. Increasing the energy input only increases the rate of boiling, and energy is wasted as steam escapes. There is a way of cooking foods in water that saves time and energy, improves food safety, and keeps the flavours and nutrition in. It is the pressure cooker. How does it work? The pressure temperature phase diagram for water shows that the boiling temperature is not fixed, but depends on the pressure. At atmospheric pressure, one bar, the boiling temperature of water is 100 degrees Celsius, or 373 Kelvin. However, at two bar, the boiling temperature of water is not 100 degrees Celsius, but 121 degrees Celsius, or 394 Kelvin. The pressure cooker consists of a strong pot and lid, a seal to keep the pressure in, and safety devices to prevent overpressuring. The science of pressure cooking is simple. Cook with water in a sealed pot that controls the pressure inside to around 2 bar. Heating the water to boiling temperature produces steam, but since it can't escape, the pressure and temperature steadily rises. In a short time, the pressure inside reaches the control point, and it is then controlled either by letting some steam out or by reducing the energy input. The food is now cooking at 121 degrees Celsius. The kinetics of all the food's chemical reactions now operate faster because of the higher temperature. Here's Dale Lyman, cookery instructor at William Anglis. We use pressure cooking in the restaurant and also to train students for culinary competitions. The pressure cooker is going to save time not only in cooking but also in cleaning time. The pressure cooker will cut cooking time up to 70%. It's also going to kill any microorganisms because of such a high temperature and pressure. Because it's a sealed unit, it will keep all the flavour and nutrients inside the pot. I use pressure cooking at home, again for the same reasons. We want the uh, quality result at the end in the quickest time possible. When the cooking is done, remove the cooker from the heat, release the pressure and carefully open up. Enjoy a tender, healthy, flavoursome and nutritious meal prepared in a fraction of the time. All thanks to chemistry.